Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, everybody. How are we doing tonight? You'll notice the lights are all nice and orange. Um, it's been a, it's been a fun day. Halloween is, Halloween's a big day for me usually. Um, it, uh, it's an important day in my life. Um, not just because Halloween has lots of candy involved. It's always been, it's always been a good time. Um, I, I do love the, the, the holiday as it were. I don't know if you can count it as an actual holiday holiday, which is funny because actually I had to work today. Again, I work weekends. I say it all the time. Uh, and holiday weekends are usually really, really quiet. Hilariously, this weekend was also quiet, even though no one takes Halloween as a as an official uh, an official holiday, which I find hilarious, hilarious. So work was really chill today, and so my wife and I were like, "We have some time. Let's uh, set up some extra extra Halloween decorative stuff." And I, I decided to take my my different lights all around, and I was like, "Let's just let's just orangeify everything. Let's just get them in all the windows." And so our house was just glowing orange, and it was a lot of fun. We had a good Halloween. Um, I had to be on my computer for most of the day, which really, really kind of sucked. Um, and so we were handing out candy. We had a, a handful of people come. It wasn't like a lot of people. Um, I feel like we live in a neighborhood with a lot of old people. <laughs> I feel like there's not a lot of young-ish families by any means or just or that many kids around. And so um, we had a lot of people drive up to our place. Um, to come and trick or treat, so that was pretty good. And um, I hope I hope y'all enjoyed your uh, your your Halloween, and I hope it was fun. Whatever you decided to do, I mean, some people decide to go to parties, some people you know trick or treat with their kids, other people um, you know give out candy, some people really really hide from the kids, you know, just shut off all the lights, pretend we're not here, and maybe watch uh, spooky movies or something. Which I, I've done that once before, or a couple times as an adult. Um, but, uh, Halloween's a big deal for me, uh, primarily because, let me find it actually, hold on. Let's see, is this the right one? Maybe it's under this one. Um, Halloween has always been a big part of my life. Um, but on this, this merry, merry day, I actually can't find the pictures. Here, oh, here they are, here they are. Let's see if I can, let's, uh, let's see. Oh, let's do this. Oh yeah, this, oh my gosh. This is, this is strange. This is going to be, this is, this is, uh, am I doxing anything of myself? Not really, other than I guess necessarily where I went to college, if you could piece it together. Um, and I guess this is a picture of my wife. So I don't think I've actually shown a picture. Well, I've had my wife on stream a couple times. So people have seen my wife. She's not, she's not necessarily a, a, a secret person. Um, but, uh, this was, this was the, the day I decided to propose to my now wife. Um, so Halloween's a big deal to me. Um, and the main reason I decided this of all days to do how or to do an engagement was number one, I really wanted to get married to this woman cause she's awesome. She really, really is just, she's just the best person. And, 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 and I'm sorry for everyone else who didn't get to marry the best person in the world. Cause that was, that befell to me and it was awesome. Um, but the main reason I think that I chose Halloween uh, part of it was because it had to be a surprise. Okay. It had to be some form of surprise. Now, the reason I say it like that is because, because we had been in the talks of it. We were actually like really serious about getting married. Um, and we really wanted to. And to some degree, to some degree, I needed there to be a little bit of surprise. And as, as, as a matter of fact, I mean, I think she was actually concerned uh, for a certain amount of time because we had been talking about getting married for a while but she had quite noticed with an empty finger uh an empty finger <laughs> a non-ringed finger that um I hadn't asked her yet I hadn't asked her yet and uh and I was like well it, it needs to be a surprise I can't I can't tell her when it's gonna happen and uh I was just like all right we're gonna do it on Halloween because that's weird and fun we had coordinated a Halloween costume set up as uh, as you can notice we were we were nerding pretty hard then with repping the 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 shield agent hydra agent bit i mean you could say we're sky and ward but it it, it was more just like we're, we're just doing we're just doing romeo and juliet with with logos here okay that's that's all that's all it really is um and so i we had we had designed these costumes we got it all set up and i was like this is gonna be a great day because I can sneak this up on her. 
Okay, actually, I should probably... My camera angles are a little messed up. I was playing with my camera earlier, and all my angles are messed up. I feel like I'm giving you a lot of... I'm giving you a lot of chest. I don't know. I feel like... Hmm. Hmm. Now, nah, nah, see, now I'm ruining my story, because I'm like, I don't know how I feel about my camera angles. Um, but I had the I had the vest. You can see that I have this tactical vest. And I had all these pockets, and it was easy to hide a ring in. It was perfect, because um, I spent the whole day with that ring in my pocket. I had classes that day. I went to class dressed as a Hydra agent, because I'm weird. Um, I think we were some of the only few people who were doing Halloween anymore. Lots of college kids do Halloween. I think we were, like, some of the only few. But everyone loved my costume, because I put a lot of work into it. You'll also notice her brand new red chucks and my old blue chucks. Really, really old. Like the the, the soles are coming off of them. They're really old. It's it old, but it, it it was worth it because chucks go with everything. Um, I've never not worn chucks in my life. Basically, <laughs> it was Vans before that, but I, I I moved over to Converse very quickly. And so. Ooh, <clears throat> too much chocolate today, man. I, I ate too much candy. Again, we didn't have enough trick-or-treaters. They didn't take it all. I had to eat it myself. Um, had to be a surprise. We put a lot of work into this, and it was just it was just going to be a fun thing, and I had already... The other thing was is I wanted there to be pictures of such a momentous event. Um, and so what I did was is I said, hey, you know our one friend, he... Is a photographer he takes photos he does that sort of thing and i'm gonna call him up and you know he can actually i was living with him at the time he was my roommate um and i was like he can take photos of our awesome costumes we did such a good job with it and like we get we i think we had gotten photos before for some reason just for fun um but i was like yeah no this would be fun we put a lot of work into this right she's like yeah no i guess that's fine um and the funniest thing about this was that i don't know <sighs> I don't know what got into him, but my roommate who was going to take the pictures was more nervous than me. I was like, look, just take pictures of us. We're going to take good pictures. And then I'm going to turn her and say, hey, marry me, woman, or, or you know, whatever I said. Uh, literally, it was just like, be my wife, wucha. Um, <laughs> be my wife, wucha. That's what it was. And uh, and he's like, and you just need to take pictures. You don't, don't worry about it. You don't even need to say anything. Just say hi and go click, click, click. That's all I need you to do. He was really nervous about it. Um, but yeah, Halloween Halloween was the day I decided to get engaged to my wife. And uh, I don't regret it because we basically, we, we get inventive for Halloween every every year for the most part. And some of them we've had to be a little bit lazy. But uh, it, it, we, we do have, have fun with Halloween. It's, it's kind of, it's, it's definitely a special day for us. Just, just remembering that moment and all that has transpired since then. I love 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 my wife um we've almost been together for six years now um as i fix as i fix this webcam oh my goodness um good enough right anyway i've been married to my wife for a solid six years uh coming up on a solid six years anyway um and it's fantastic and i will let you all know this is the first time i'm gonna say it on stream um my wife and i are pregnant and i'm really super over the moon about that um, it is something that we've long waited for and is, is going to be the best thing ever. <laughs> it's going to be so good. I'm really, really excited. Um, so next year there will be another me walking around. Well, I think a lot of people are scared of that, that prospect. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited guys. Oh, my wife is pregnant and I'm so, so happy. I don't, I don't really know how to else to voice it. We finally... Uh, it took us a little bit. We uh, obviously our families knew. Um, we we had let a few other people know, and then we only recently uh, posted about it to let just like the general world know because we're comfortable at this point and it's good. So we're like, hey, we're pregnant. I haven't said it on stream yet, so I, I and I have held back like multiple. The, gosh, like just for the past month at least, I have stopped myself from saying it just because I felt like I was like we haven't really said it to everybody, and I don't just want to let it slip on stream. So like, oh, it's embarrassing. So now it's been said. So if there's any jokes about us having a baby, uh, it's because we're actually having a baby. <laughs> oh, Halloween's the best. Today, uh, uh, for this lovely year of Halloween, my wife and I uh, we reused some clothing we recently purchased for another uh, another. Uh, another get together as it were but uh we, we we dressed up in our uh our old west cowboy 
cowgirl kind of get up stuff. We actually kind of look more like uh, we look more like prospectors. But anyway, I got I got this old shirt that's got like the lines and stuff. You can't really see it because of the spooky lighting. It's hard to see, but it's and the shirt's got like the, the the you know the snaps and stuff. It's just all all cowboy ish. And then the boots, dude. The boots. Let me tell you, if Nashville's known for anything, it's selling you an enormous amount of boots for no reason. Um, these boots, I love these boots, dude. I don't wear cowboy boots. I have no need for legitimate cowboy boots, but I I really like these things. They're they're just they're just nice. They're fun. They're fun to LARP in as a cowboy. Because y'all know me, I'm a LARPer. Hardcore LARP. That's what we do here on this channel, is we LARP. I, I need to start LARPing for every every stream. That would be that would be good. Um, let's see. Yeah, the lights are all strewn everywhere as well back there, just because uh, we use them for decorations, guys. They're just, it's just everywhere. It's fine. Uh, we're not going to worry about it. So first on the docket for today... I was kind of leaning towards trying out uh, boop. Conscript. Conscript is a game I've seen a lot about. It's not out yet. As you can see, it says demo. That's a, that's a demo there. Um, this game is supposed to be an isometric survival horror. So essentially, it's another Resident Evil. <laughs> but uh, oh, it's supposed to be like Resident Evil Silent Hill-esque, inspired by those things but played it or the story anyway is you are a french soldier i believed who is conscripted into world war one and uh, you're trying to find your brother i think um so i think we'll start there i think that'll be a good time to start with um let me let me just uh let's see i haven't actually opened this game at all i'm excited excited for it i've i've seen a few different videos for it and things and there's been other demos but this is i think this is a newer demo so we're gonna try it out um uh, sorry, I just, just going to tweet about it. I've been waiting to try this game. Um, get scared with me, that's what we'll say. I'm I'm a terrible typer, kids. Like the worst. I think uh, I think I rate real slow on the typing scale, if you know what I mean. I can't remember the last time I took a test if I I think I had to have at least eighty words per minute back in the day. I do I do believe that's that's what it was. So let's change our stream title as well. Gosh. I'm so excited for next year, guys. Gonna have a kid. Might move from where I am. Don't know yet. Conscript. Is that the game? Yeah, no, that's the one. Okay. Just didn't have a cover, so I was confused. Done. All right. We have updated the things. We've hit the buttons. Let's, uh, let's see what this game does for us, shall we? Boom. I guess we'll just go over to display. We'll just start here. We'll see how this goes. Also, I think this game, hopefully the stream doesn't die. This game is still in early development. Everything is subject to change. Jordan Mochi. This game contains scenes of explicit violence and gore. That's almost uh, just a necessary statement to add, honestly, if you if you play any of <laughs> these sorts of games, right? Let's see, if, uh, let's see if this one actually pops it up. Hold on. There it is. That's nice press any button. Yeah, I'm really excited about this game because one kid is, is putting it together. I believe he's a college student. Um, and I've been following, I, I wasn't able to donate to his campaign. Uh, the, uh, cause he had like a Kickstarter, but, uh, I was watching, I, I've been watching the, the work he's been doing and I follow him on Twitter and things. Um, he's doing a lot of interesting stuff and I'm, I'm excited to see where it's at with this demo. And I'm, more than likely going to be buying it when it comes out. I'm not sure when he, if he has a slated estimate, but let's see how it goes. Oh, spooky time. Ooh, he's, he's got options and everything already. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mouse, rumble, aim mode. Let's just see. I'm imagining controller works. I believe it does, but I mean, it's, it's working right now on the menus. 
let's just let's just start it. Let's just figure it out as we go. Uh, assisted difficulty mode, soldier standard intended for difficult settings. Recommended for a first time playthrough. Sounds good. Veteran for veteran players. Full game only options. Oh, these are gonna be like your your super hardcore modes. Okay, unlimited saves. Saves will not cost consumable items. No, we're mans. We're big mans. Play with save checkpoints. Eh. Enlist. <laughs> Sign your name with a dotted line. Son, you're dead. You go die for your country. Let's do it. July 11th, 1916. Dear Ma, I hope you are doing well. It has been four weeks now since I have been stationed at Verdun. Ooh, ooh, not good, not good. It is with great relief that I can finally write back home to you. I know you have been thinking about Pierre. He made a full recovery after being gassed and was sent up to Fort Sobel to continue fighting. Jeez, that quickly. I'm still stuck in this miserable, miserable support trench a few hundred meters downhill. I mean, they didn't cover that much ground in World War One, really. We have been fighting the Germans over these forts, over these old forts for weeks on end. Some have swapped hands multiple times over the past months. See, that's the thing is people just... Trench warfare, dude, it was, it was terrible because it was just pushed back and forth and not a lot of ground exchanged hands, really. I don't see what the point is anymore. The fort and our trench have no more artillery. Our water is poisoned and supplies are low. Telephone lines have been severed beyond repair, and communication from command has been dreadfully slow. Anybody see 1917? It's a very good film. <laughs> We're waiting for those boys, I bet. Although tomorrow, our platoon will be shifted south back to the village to resupply. It will be a relief to feel clean water on my skin once again. Was this before you were uh, questioned about what was in your letters to not, or like, were they told not to give away uh, any information? <laughs> it's a good question. I will bring both of us home, Ma. Worry not. Promises made, promises kept. It's, my controller's vibrating like crazy now. I will write. Dot, dot, dots. Shaking. They're back. The voices. <laughs> Oh, wow, okay. Monster flying around the flame of the lantern. I need to find Pierre and get to the front lines. He's probably still up at Fort Solval. Hey, isn't right. Okay, good, it tutorializes. Excellent. Imagine everything's chill before it goes crazy. All right, so that is menu. Oh, we can get smokes, gun parts, ink. Okay, is ink our uh, save? Ooh, map door open oh he's got a nice map system i'm already excited for this this is also just me exploring functionality so we'll also have files much like everything else oh we can go back to our letter oh shoot okay cool 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 and then the options menu cool move items yeah the door won't budge certain doors have been locked due to enemy trench raids a key is required all right, well, let's show me that door now. I'm just curious. How did I get over there last? Yeah, like that. Yeah, locked. Support trench. Okay, whoa, it's a little finicky. Yeah, it's just me. Ooh, yes, please. Take the kniff. You picked up the kniff. Equip the, ooh, examine. Military grade combat knife issued to recruits. Incredibly durable and reliable in any circumstance. 0.5 damage, cool. <laughs> Assign. Assign action to what button? Oh. Oh, sick. How do I ready myself? Uh, left trigger. And then right to so I can hit this to just slash. Oh, I have a stamina meter and everything? Oh, shoot, I can go this way. I didn't think I'd be able to go this way. Field operations manual. When under fire, remember the basics of your field training. Different weapon types have different firing styles. Check your weapons before going into battle. Only engage in close quarters combat if absolutely necessary. These are important things to learn. You can sprint to outrun the enemy. If you are fatigued, you will be easy pickings. If surrounded, you can perform a combat roll to avoid the enemy strikes. <laughs> Remember your training, boys, roll. 
All right, various items can be used from the inventory. Weapons can be assigned for instant use. Oh yeah, we've seen this. Certain items can be combined to create medicines, ammunition, and tools for the field. If space is limited, consumable items and ammo can be discarded. To think carefully before doing so. Always pay attention to space in your field bag. Only take what is necessary for the victory and survival. Always be vigilant. The enemy can strike from anywhere. Stick to assigned trenches. Keep your head down and only advance when ordered by your company commander. We ha uh, we want to bring you home to your family safely. Cool. We got some smokes. All right, so we should be able to. Whoops. Oh come on, these are. Oh, I guess I can kind of aim this, huh? Yeah, we break barrels. Yeah. Oh, sweet. All right, so now we got six. We got eight smokes. We're going to be smoking all day. Can't that bug, can I? Probably not. All right. Uh, is that something to read? Guess not. All right, this guy doesn't look like he's doing so hot. Also, it's like I can dodge roll. How do I dodge roll? That's what I want to know. Is this just uh, is this just survival horror game? Yeah, so it's World War One, and we are playing a French soldier who's trying to find his brother. Um, and uh, I I hear it has varying levels of whether, uh, like you'll be fighting actual enemy soldiers, but there's also some kind of spooky paranormally stuff kind of going on as well i think it means what it looks like from like the trailers he's made but henry spooked door won't budge certain doors have been locked due to enemy trench raids we need another key okay okay that x will make a sprint get to the front line okay is that in order private where have you been they're at do a mall is that would that be do a mall we will not let them take it again. We're providing f support for Fort Sovel. I'll throw my brother is. Get moving now. Sprinting. We run out of energy that way. All right, smacking also uses energy. How do you roll? I really want to know how to roll. They didn't tell me how to roll. War horror is so intense. This looks like a creepy game. Oh, it's it's, it's already pretty spooks. I'm really excited because there's one kid making it and it looks like he's got a, a dream in, in mind and I like this. Keep your head in the trench during all hours of daylight. In case of enemy shelling, take shelter in trench dugouts. All right, let's, there's an empty, oh, there's a lot of people down there. So let's check on these guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, I hate this. Nothing over here to use. Hey, does anybody want to talk about it? Just a kid. Oh, can I look at this guy? No, I can walk on him though. He can't talk right now. Seems to be completely dazed. Oh, oh wait. Oh, okay. Can I look at him? Okay, I thought it was a different one. Looks like it was the same. All right, they're not. They're not doing good. They're war, war is hell. Very much war is hell. Wait, what's it? Oh, can I climb up? Barbed wire has been destroyed here, making this trench more susceptible to raids. Oh, if I had extra wire, I could patch it up. Okay, let's go find some barbed wire. What is that? Okay, it's a soldier. <laughs> he was gassed last night. Best to just leave him be. Ugh. Ugh. Is this where I leave people to die? Absolutely love games that are made by a single guy with a vision. Yeah, no. Uh, it's gonna be okay, dude. Uh, you'll be fine. I'm just gonna let you... Can I put him out of his misery? I'd actually be... I'd feel bad, but it might be necessary. Not really sure where I need to go, but we're exploring. Oh, is this a hidey? Yeah, it's a hidey spot. Oh, I like that. Okay. Dodger roll left bumper. Okay. He taught me something. I've learned. You okay, buddy? They're here. Oh, that's not good. That's not what I wanted to hear. Love me some screams of death. Yeah, I know there's a lot of that. Oh, this is our chest. We have a chest system, yay. All right. A dimly lit lamp sits beside a journal. 
write a journal entry and record your part. Okay, so this is how we save. Um, how much? You left the journal as is. How much? Oh, that's that menu. I have two ink pads, so I guess we can save just so we don't have to go through all this. I mean, it's again, it's a demo, so we're just gonna trench soldier ten minutes. All right. Oh, that was kind of a cool lamp effect. I like that. All right, got my knife. I know how to dodge roll. I'm a hero. Let's go. Can I hit these boxes? I don't know. Every crate here is empty. We have been completely out of supply for three weeks. Okay, what about these though? These supply barrels look like they can be smashed open. Okay, yeah, so this is where it's trying to tutorialize me about boxes. Okay, aiming. Okay, aiming, aiming works. Thought about complaining for a second. Not gonna do it, not gonna do it. But these, these, these ones can't be broken apparently. Leave this out. Door appears to be locked from either side. It's over here to the right. Fort Solo via communication trench. Pigeon coop. Got a pigeon coop. Send out orders. Okay. More smokes. Am I going to be trading smokes for like items and stuff? Take the trench shovel. Picked up the trench shovel. Salmon. Trench shovel used for digging ditches also makes for a good close quarters weapon. Oh, but it's got a, it's got a, it's got like a meter on it. So I don't know if I can only use it a certain amount of time. Equip weapons and tools from your field bag. Always be ready for combat. Hmm. Door won't budge. Yep, yep, yep. Let's come out this way. Oh, why did it feel the need to tell me that? This way to the enemy, I guess. All right, take the bandage. <laughs> so we are gonna be fighting in a second. All right. Oh, shoot. Uh, what do we do? Run by him. Run by him. I'm gonna find my brother. Did he follow me? He did not. Okay. <laughs> Pierre? He's badly wounded. Oh, it's my brother. I need to move him. Oh, shoot. We found our brother. That was quick. <laughs> Game over, I guess. <laughs> there we go. If I don't get to the front lines, I'll be shot. I'll be back for you, brother. Oh, okay. So it's not the fact that I need to find him. It's that I know where he is. And I need to get him out of here. German trench raider seems he was stabbed in the chest. Can I stab him again? This the way to the this way to the front lines. Also, I left that guy really close to where my brother's at. I, I can smoke for the rest of my life. Oh my god, I have 43 smokes. Can I trade these for a gun, please? Also, I don't know where the front lines are, so this is it's gonna be embarrassing. Oh, there's something in here. Five more cigarettes. Attention, check your firearms before going into combat. Only engage in close quarters if necessary. Yeah, yeah. Rifle rounds, yes. One rifle rounds. Ah, this is going up and out. I have no I have no weapon. I have a knife. I need to get to the front lines. Also, I feel like there's more more places I could have gone back there as well. Okay, this door's locked. All right, I feel like I'm kind of being pushed this way though. Do I equip the shovel? Wrong button. Yeah, it does more damage, son. Oh, yes, take the rifle. I only have one, uh, only one bullet though, so that's... Let's switch back to this. Oh, I have to charge it up, yeah. Be a big man. All right, we have two bullets now. <laughs> you know when I can't find the front line that I have a million cigarettes to show for it? Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, all I have are cigarettes. I gotta stop doing that. That's why. It's just like, just like the old days. Of, uh... All right, which... 
Uh, we'll have this be left for now, and you can be right. All right, aiming. Oh, it's so twitchy. He twitches. All right, but yeah, we can point in every direction. Yeah, it's it's hilarious not being able to find out where the war is at, but I can smoke myself to death. He is <laughs> French after all. No, you're right. Door appears to be locked from the other side. Yeah, no, he's, he's French. Cigarettes are very important. It's a big part of our culture. Huge, honestly. All right, I have to go kill people, brother. We'll be back. Door won't budge. Okay, that, that is not the front lines. We wouldn't lock the front lines. <laughs> you wouldn't... You wouldn't download the front lines. Pierre. Oh, shoot. Yeah, get wrecked. Vive la France. <laughs> for the for the king? Do do they still fight for the king? I don't I don't know if they fight for the king anymore. Great bumper to reload weapon. Am I not reloaded? I'm imagining I'm fine. It's not blue though, and it has an exclamation point. Does that mean I'm not loaded? He's not even pointing, aiming down sight. Hold on. Unequip examine. High powered standard issue French infantry rifle, low fire rate. Reload speed is zero. Do I actually have to like come in here and like. It would be funny if I had to literally combine this every time with this. Okay, I could just hit right trigger again. Okay, my, my bad, my bad. Not a fan. Oh, it was shooting him made a squishy sound. Yeah, no, no, shooting people usually makes a squishy sound. Uh, are you guys my buddies? I can't tell if you're German or not. That helmet looks pretty German though. You guys want to talk about it? Oh yeah, they're not good. They're bad mans. Oh, they're very bad mans. Reload. Oh, reloads. Okay. <laughs> that did not go this planned. Didn't look like they were wearing the same color. But we had to be sure. Did they reset? They're resetting. <laughs> Well, let's try this again. Yeah. All right, let's uh, shovel time. Yeah. Get it. That's right. For France. Do you? <laughs> She's like, do you hear the people sing as I beat a man to death with a shovel? Jeez. Singing the songs of angry men. It is the duty of a people to kill others with shovels. Um, do I want to write a journal entry about how I just, just demolished a few men? Goodness. All right, shovels taking some hits. Take chemical fluid. Okay, that sounds like a story item right there. Oh, this sounds bad. Take the bandages. Look in our chest. Okay, bandages don't stack, so we're gonna put away a bandage. Uh, put away the knife as well, because we have we have a shovel. Um, and I checked. Oh, we have we have a couple inks. We're, let's just save. We're not we're not we're not going hardcore or anything. We will save. I'm liking this a lot so far. Oh, I haven't dodge rolled yet. I, I should have dodge rolled. Probably dodge bullets when people are right about to shoot at you. I have this, okay, that, that man's French. So I saw another man like him earlier. He's gotta be French, he's gotta be a buddy, yeah. Private, Fort Dumont has fallen. Oh no, if they get down here, we are finished. Get out there and defend this soil with your life. I'll be in here hiding. Uh, what are you waiting for? Do you want one in the back of your head? Get moving. They shall not pass. <laughs> Good Gandalf reference. All my friends are dead. 
cool. Alright, well, I guess we're loading up. Defend the front line. Shoot, can I hide in here? Door is locked very tightly. Alright. Is there a pillbox over here? Probably we need a machine gun ammo to thin them out. Our guns are effing empty. Alright. I'm on it! Nothing better to do than run with bullets. Or have bullets running by. I'm guessing this is explosive? It looks explosive. I'm not gonna hit it with a knife, that's for sure. Soldier, are you okay? Oh, you are not okay. Saw that shadow coming. This is a big shell. Okay, he's he's asphyxiating. That's fine, that's fine. Just need to get our machine gun ammo. Is this it? No, that's not it. Oh, we get some from this one. Oh, shoot! Let's hit like that. Oh. Oh, shoot. That was a light hit. Got him. Ah! For France! Oh, I missed him. <laughs> France! France! Oh, they're coming, dude. They're. they're oh, they. The years start coming and they don't stop coming. I just want my ammo. Oh, the arrow points that way now. All right, this guy. Is, this guy is fast. All right. He kind of stops for a second though. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, you jerk! He counters. Ah! Oh, so strong. He's got a friend. Oh, it didn't get. That sounded like it took him out. All right. Bandage time. A medium portion of health was restored. Goodness. Shovel a man to death for France. <laughs> what World War One are we all about? Yeah, that's, that's it's a good question. This World War One is very interesting, to say the least. All right, we have we have a lot of bullets. Wait, thirteen rifle rounds. But is this three right here? Oh, is that me? That's the item slot or something. I don't know what that means. All right. We need to reload this gun. We don't have any friends to help either. All right, reload it. Oh, yeah, we need to aim it. Shoot. <laughs> Aiming's, aiming is for the weak. All right, we should probably use these barrels, though. Oh. Alright. Oh, didn't take out the tanky boy. Took out the other one. I'm hearing whistles. I'm hearing whistles. Don't like them. Die! Die! Yes! Another one? Are you kidding me? Alright. War as hell. What was this? More ammo? Machine gun rounds. Cool. Do I need more? Is that enough? Is, is uh, 20 bullets enough to thin the herd? Of Germans. Yeah, get dodge rolled, son. You guys got any bullets to share? Alright. We're just sharing our bullets with everybody. You okay, sir? He's not okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's, just, it's just a man who's gonna save France by dodge rolling his way out of the war. It's perfect. First aid kit, yes, I will take that. Thank you, sir. Oh, oh, I missed the dodge. Oh! How about that first aid kit, huh, kids? Um, <laughs> let's, let's use it. Health fully restored, infections cured. Okay, so that's your, that's your blue, green, and red herb right there, okay. We have learned. Dodge, dodge. Dodge again, oh, you jerks, all right. Eat. Shovel. Ah. Beamed him. Oh, he hit first. Yeah, that's right. All right, we don't have a lot of time. Keep hitting the wrong button. Reload. Reload. Oh, shoot. Have I been doing this wrong the whole time? 
I think I have been. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We're gonna find more ammo. We're gonna save France this way. This is how you save France. For all those of you who have been asking, shotgun shells. Is that a shotgun over there? Pump shotgun. Yes, sir. I will take that. Thank you. For France, I will do it. An American volunteer. Didn't seem to have too much to say about that, now, did he? Alright. That is a heavily armored man who doesn't know where I am. Thank goodness. Alright. Just like RE4 all over again. Alright. Equip the pump shotgun, because we want to try it. Oh, that's the front of our gun nest over here. They come in this way, because they come this way. I'm going to just blow that thing up. That's another way down. Oh my goodness! Oh my, oh my, my. Oh, I put away, that's right, I put away my other bandage. Oh, we're done for, guys. So I was like, we're gonna not, not gonna need two bandages immediately, are you kidding? Oh, that guy died from shelling. Oh. Get dunked on. Uh. He didn't care. <laughs> he didn't care. Have I already been here? I'm actually losing track of where I've been. Alright, let's, in such cases, look at the map while we're being chased by a killer. Alright, that's a locked door. We're at Fort Silval now. There's a circle up here. I've been down there for sure. Yeah, so we dropped down back to where we've been before. So we have kind of a loop here. Um... There were two gunner positions. Well, I gave bullets to one gunner position. Do I need to give them to another as well? I'll leave this guy kind of in the dust. He's really slow. Oh, this is a dead end, right? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness for mortar fire. All right. Return to Pierre. Oh, okay. I have, I have a mission objective. Cool. That was close. Reload. Oh, that's gaseous. Oh, I don't like that. That's bad, that's bad gas. Oh, the bunker got taken out. Do we have a gas mask in here? Anybody have a leftover gas mask? Ooh, ooh, gas. You don't want the mustard gas. First aid kit heals bullets and shovel wounds in your infected hangnail and all in one go. Yes, yes, no, 100%. As the the Pog uh, first aid kit from World War One, <laughs> they, they haven't been able to replicate it. All right, big shadow means big shell. Doesn't make much sense, but I'll I'll allow it. For video games, it makes sense. Oh shoot, we are just trying to book it away from the gas here. Take the trench key. All right. We own the trenches now. You have locked the door. Oh, I was always getting dark. Um. Sh oh. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Shovel's kind of weak now. Um. Pierre, bro, you okay? Oh, that takes some time to aim, and it is. Might not be our. Best answer. Okay, not that kind of key is required. All right. I don't remember where my brother is. Is he south? Guys, I don't know. I'm lost. Oh, there's a save journal up there. Shoot. No, I found Pierre right there, right? Because wasn't he right by the front lines? That or is back there? I'm going to go risk it to get stuff. Didn't I leave a guy out here who wanted to kill me? We have a, thank goodness. All right. So I don't know what we need the chemical fluid for. We're gonna, yeah, shovel's basically done for. Take the bandage. Do I want the knife? I guess, yeah, we'll save the shotgun for now. The shotgun was all right. 
Might use up all of our stuff in one go here. All right, cool. And then you sign you back to our top one. Knife. Cool. We did it. How much ink do I have? Two. We'll save. Or we'll save our ink. We will not save the game. Pierre! I'm gonna bring you home the mama. It's gonna be okay, brother. Don't worry about the gases. Uh-oh. Pierre is gone, but someone has left a note here. Urgent orders. Oh, jeez. To the company commander, they are planning a second attack, and we are out of men who are fit to fight. The fort is now in their control, and southern trenches will follow. If the support trench falls, withdraw your men and regroup at the town. Leave any wounded soldiers in the medic bay. If they are not killed, they will be taken as prisoners of war. We will retrieve them later. Runner's note was logged into your notes. So, did someone pull our brother out, or was he captured it's not pierre the soldier must have been a runner looks like he went through hell to get here 1917 good movie um a german trench raider seems to have been set in the chest here i looked at him all right nothing else here kind of want to get my rifle out yeah trench rifling oh frick <laughs> it's just get murked immediately no. <laughs> God script. All right, is that is that is that the the late title card or is that the whole demo? Cuz either way I'm content with that. That was cool. Okay. 1 hour later. I was thinking about that movie being runner was probably the most dangerous job in the world, right? Because you were alone, you had no backup. You just had to cover so much territory. One hour later. He didn't murder me, apparently. But I'm in a pile of bodies. Mm. Excuse my human need for water. Take the ruby pistol. Yeah. Couldn't have a diamond pistol, though. Mm -hmm. Was I dragged in here? I mean, yeah, they probably thought we were dead. Jean, Henry, that's most of the platoon. <laughs> Some of them have charred skin. Others look like they haven't been touched, but they're gone. Ugh. Oh, no. Thirsty boy. Yeah, no, I'm drinking a lot. All right. Equip. Have bullets for this boy? We have nine bullets for this bullety boy. Let's use them up, shall we? <laughs> Actually, how much damage does this thing do? Semi-automatic Spanish manufactured pistol, standard issue for French armies. Interesting. Fire rate 0.5, capacity 9, firepower 1. It's firepower damage, I'm guessing. Firepower for this is 2, yeah, so we have a higher capacity and quicker fire rate. Fine, Pierre. But does less damage. It's fine, fine. I will right, we'll gun down a few peeps. To find Pierre. Take the pistol rounds. Heck yeah. Alright, this is our hidey spot. This is our hidey hole. If we need to hide, we hide there. I've been in here yet. set up a quick key for my pistol I need I need the quick action keys it's like right here isn't it oh I don't I don't like it guys I don't know where I'm supposed to be going honestly let's not go here just yet let's see how well this thing does huh Oh! Got him, but we lost a lot of health doing that. All right. So honestly, stealth is not a bad idea. 
Especially with the aiming time. Because you can't really squeeze off two shots that are... Because uh, I'm guessing it. I'm guessing you can miss. It didn't look like I missed those two times with how close he was, though. Dude, we're going to be smoking for ages. We're going to have so much lung cancer. Not even going to know what to do with ourselves. Okay. Um, I wish there was, like, a, a dedicated map button. There it is. I found it. Okay, so it looks like there's some stuff I haven't really looked at yet. Item storage, door open, door locked. Are these locked from other side? Support trench. I have the key for the trench though, right? Alright, let's let's try and rifle this man, shall we? Oh! Oh, I didn't reload it. Dodge roll. Ah! No! Don't you do it. That jerk. Alright. So this is locked on the other side. Unlock it. Yeah. We gotta hold the support trench, kids. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, we have to. Oh, wait. Right bumper. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Alright, where's me knife? Oh, oh yeah, the pigeon coop. That's where we are. We flew the coop. Found the pigeon coop. Another little birdie. Oh, there he is. Hello. There's only one messenger pigeon left here, but the cage has been locked. I need to send for help. Anything else? I saw a shiny over here. There's only one messenger pigeon. Okay. All right, well, we need a way to unlock the pigeon coop. Killing or wounding a homing pigeon is punishable by six months imprisonment or a larger fine. We remind you that homing pigeons are doing valuable work for the government in war effort. Yikes. No pigeons alive in this one. Emergency. They have the fort and are dropping heavy artillery on support trenches. There are many wounded and cannot evacuate. We are suffering. Send help for heaven's sake. I guess I'm going to put that on a pigeon and send it out. Because <laughs> that sounds like the thing to do. Ooh, more bullets. I read this. Yeah. Always be ready for combat. I feel like I've somewhat gotten used to the combat. All right, so oh yeah, that one's locked. Dodge roll, sprint. All right, I need I need to find stuff. Oh my goodness! All right, so if I shoot like this, that hit him. It does. That hit him. Okay, it just didn't seem to do as well as it could have. Right, reload you. Yeah, what does it take to reload a pistol like that? Got a lever in another one. There we go. All right. <laughs> they don't drop loot. It's a problem. I wish they dropped loot. Side of this head looks like it was caved in with a shovel. Or as hell. Oh, this is not Pierre. I know where I am. Alright, we're going the wrong way then. We may eventually need to go this way, but we're supposed to be holding the support trench. Yeah, this is going exactly the wrong way. But we killed some dudes and we didn't lose any health, so I'm happy with it. I really love the art design of this game. I really like what he's going for. Again, if you if you watch my streams, you kind of notice I I gravitate towards very pixely games nowadays. <laughs> Just something endearing and loving, lovable about it. 
Poilu? You frightened me. Is that my name or is that just a, a nickname? <gasps> is this our merchant? Good day, Poilu. What will it be? <gasps> Trade, upgrade, talk. Oh, let's talk. Looks like it's just you and me left. It all happened so fast, those bastards. Our deal still stands. Let me know if you have any spare cigarettes. Here's the guy we pour all our cigarettes into. And if you happen to find any gun parts, I can fix up some of your weapons. Well, what are you waiting for? Trade. Oh. All right. F 15 ink tablets that can be used for writing journal entries. Gun so I can buy gun parts from him. Buy an ammo pouch. Military grade ammo pouch that can be attached to your uniform increases the amount of ammunition you can carry per bag slot by 10%. Ooh. Standard issue field bag. So it gives us more space. So we can buy guns. So yeah, he's been setting it up like it's RE4 essentially. So you can buy your guns. I could buy a new shovel. Trenching tool used for digging ditches. Also makes for good close quarters combat weapon. Gunpowder A. Oh yeah, let's learn all about the gunpowders. Gun Powdered lead mixed with more lead uh, to create gunpowder or add chemical fluid to craft pistol ammo. Okay, so the chemical fluids for pistol ammo. All right, so powdered lead mixed with more lead to create gunpowder or add to chemical fluid to craft rifle ammo. So rifle ammo, or so this is for pistol. A is for pistol, B is for rifle. An assortment of different chemicals combined with lead powder to create ammo can also be used as disinfectant when combined with bandages. Oh shoot, so you're choosing between new ammunition or bandages. Straight up by bandages. Heals a small amount of health, best combined with disinfecting agent. Repair kit, a toolbox filled with supplies that can be used to repair basic tools and melee weapons. Has enough supplies for one repair. Trench torch, an English torch placed in a hard leather case that can be attached to your uniform. These are quite rare. Flashlight. And we can sell stuff. Sell them the key. Oh no, it doesn't, it doesn't work. I can't sell it. All right. So we need weapon parts to do this. Okay. Cool though. All right. Uh, leave to care. What do we got? A pump shotgun and a broken, uh, and a broken shovel, huh? Oh, those some gun parts. Yeah, they are, okay. So I can either upgrade my capacity on this or my fire. So if I upgrade, Increase firepower, boom. Cool, okay, I like that. That's solid. All right, do we wanna do this bandage the cowardly way? Let's do it. Yeah, so it's one per, okay. Does that make sense? Um, let's see, we can make some more ammo. I can get another shovel. The repair kit costs more than just a new shovel. You can get a flashlight though. Flashlight might not be terrible. Let's get the flashlight, let's see how this works. I'm curious. I'm imagining normally you wouldn't want or need flashlight, but. Oh, let's combine this with the oil, yeah, and let's make a better, uh, make a better heal, because I'm low. So, combine. Disinfect and bandage. Use. Oh, look at that. All right, examine. An English torch placed in a hard leather kit. Oh yeah, I read that. Um, equip. Oh, this probably makes me glow in the dark though to enemies. Uh, yeah, let's record our progress, why not? Yeah, we probably glow in the dark with this thing, like 100%. All right, got our updated pistol. All right, let's go, let's go protect the trenches, shall we? I got a flashlight. I got a jaw dirt. I got a jaw dirt. Guess what's inside it? All right. Oh, is this the way down? Yeah. Gotta be on the lookout for stuff like that. 
Don't forget, you can run towards the camera. More, more cigarettes. Good, 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 good. I mean, I might just play this the whole night. I'm already digging this game so much. I want to find bar bar so I can lock off that spot there. Have I been in here recently? This is where I woke up. Is there a button? Especially if the flashlight does give away my position easier, I would like it if there was a button to turn that on and off instead of just having to go. The blockhouses have been locked, but we have not been told why. Interesting, a key is required. All right. Um, I was just going to say that uh, it would be nice if, if it does affect, you know, your discoverability. It would be nice if there was an option to shut it on and off without going back into the menu. Oh, I found a first aid kit. Cool. Okay. So the pistol ready. Cool. I like the pistol so far. Now, then again, the rifle hits like a truck, dude. Rifle's a good deal. Certain doors been locked. Unlock doors. More six. Do you love me, the French uh, barter system? Shh. He might not see me. Just curious on if running would like alert him any more than any other movement, but doesn't seem to. Nice, all right. That's all empty. Someone's getting murdered out there, I don't like it. I can't see anybody out there though. That, that was uncomfortable. You wanna go? Shoot. Rubble's blocking the way. Well, you could have said that. A strong artillery blast may be able to clear it. I need to call in an artillery sh Oh. I need to call in some artillery fire. Oh, he knows. He knows. <laughs> I mean, he clearly saw me run in there, but... Oh, this is terrifying. Oh, shoot. Freaking beamed me. Ow, guys. It's not funny anymore, guys. Oh, I already need to use that med kit. Shoot. All right, let's... Uh, oh, no, I wanted to use it and not die. My controller's actually freaking out a little bit. All right. My uh, major concern now is that... Uh, oh, you can kind of see the shot. I don't know if... Uh, I can't, I can't like, oh, I can't just fire a lot. Oh, I'm gonna die, guys. No, oh, no, oh. All right, got got caught on the walls a little bit, too. Whew. That was bad. All right, we lost like all our health and all our heals. Shoot. That spot was tough. Because that dude shouted and everybody came running. Everybody. Um, did I walk in here yet? I don't think I did. I may have earlier. Oh, no, this is completely new. Maybe I should have come in here first. Because those dudes are just tearing me to pieces. There's like four of them. Combat's not bad, but when there's, when there's lots of them, I haven't... I don't know what to do yet. That's a lot. I got teammates to rely on. I don't I ain't got anything. French army's just giving up. I'm not even trying to make a joke about the French giving up like they, just, they did in this game right now, right here. Okay, it's my item chest, but I mean, maybe the shotgun's a better deal right now. That could very well be. Um, 
put away the flashlight for now. Flashlight's cool. Could be nice, but for something else. But I want to look at those. I don't want to go into the thing. Just some old tattered uniforms. Okay. Oh, I'm going to keep doing that forever, dude. I don't know what my problem is. All right. Assign you to right. We're gonna shotgun people. I mean, the, the heavy armored guys seem to shrug this off like it's nothing. So maybe that shouldn't be my go-to. Yeah, what's this say? Artillery trench, medic bay to the right. Medic bay? All right, which one's which though? Guess we're gonna find out. Also, we're gonna get killed real quick. I think it's been a minute since I saved too. Bandage? Wire spool. I'll allow that. Oh. Crates full of barbed wire. Excellent. I like that. What? Uh, door has been completely sealed with barbed wire. The only way to get through is to cut it. Alright. Don't have much to cut with. That's where the artillery trench and medic bay is. Okay, so we found where barbed wire is. Please don't murder me. Gun parts, I think. Yeah, it's just a small room. I really like this game, guys. This is really cool. Even though I was getting bullied earlier. You're bullying hard. Unlock it. Oh, we're done with the trench key, cool. Oh, it's one of those. We're hardcore getting marks. These guys take a lot of damage to kill. So much damage. I have no health. I can't take a hit. Okay. He only came the other time because I shot that guy. Can't be removed by hand. Dude, he sounds like a demon. Alright, well. Oh, I thought, for a second I thought he wasn't gonna see. Real slow, though. He got me. <laughs> he doesn't flinch at all when you hit him. <sighs> Game 1896 to 1960. All right. All right. So we left off from here. That's not. That's not terrible. All right. All right. All right. I'll leave that for now. Let's try the shoddy ad a little bit. Oh wait, no, those are my rifle bullets. Those I want. I'm really enjoying this game. I almost don't want to put it down now. Oh, this is good. This is good. Thinking about it though, I get I get saddened that this is not the f this is not the full game. There's still more game to be made. It is still being, he is still laboring to create this beautiful project. All right, so this is where we woke up. I'm trying to create a little bit of a mental map. 
Oh, where we are and what's going on. Yeah, we came down here, we found this. Which is going to be greatly needed at some point. Okay, that's not an openable one. Door won't budge. Kind of want to go get the barb wire and barb that up. I was really excited about finding the barb wire. Oh, there's a poor guy in that ditch. Okay, not much here. Gunpowder, cool. Did we try going this way yet? Yeah, no, it's locked from the other side. Okay. Item chest. Uh, we're, hang we're hanging out of that guy for dear life. Um, got one more trench key use over here, right? Gun parts. Dude, this game. This game is solid, dude. Sealed shut would just be wire anyway. That makes me think it's not wire. <laughs> I'm gonna spool of wire. Nothing going on over here. It sounds like something's trying to get out of there this time. I can't. I don't remember if it was doing it that last time. I almost don't want to know now. All right. So we did all this. Oh, we did not come this way last time. Oh, why would you immediately do that? No. No, sir. Oh, well, we stole smokes off a dead man. Well, I'm not sleeping in the night. That's gross. That's just not nice. Alright. Okay, that door's unlocked. Alright, so that guy's made of metal. And he's gonna be real hard to kill. <laughs> I got some wire to place. It's probably another place we could use this that'd be better, but that's fine. I mean, there might be multiple spots to cover up, but at least cover up the spaces we know. All right. All right, that's our last use of the. French key. And this is where things got real, real bad. All right, so let's let's go down this narrow area where we know we can control some some stuff. I mean, four dudes, four dudes to fight was tough. Um, I mean, if the guns get stronger, or maybe the shotgun is the answer to multiple enemies. You, you would think, right? I just want to see him just so I'm pretty sure the shot will still hit did reload Run him. It's a lot of ammo to put into him though. That one seemed like it missed. Oh, 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 am I dead? No, I'm not dead. Okay, I'm just, oh, I'm just. My head just hurts. What was he trying to protect? Oh, I didn't dodge. 
That's for the dead end, right? Oh, it's not necessarily. Oh, I didn't reload it. Alright, cock it. Oh, yeah, it's too slow. You can't, uh, you can't run again with that. Oh, yeah, I have to hit A again. All right. Oh, he shrieked out in pain. Dude, it literally sounds like a demon. Oh, he gave me weapon parts, though. That's cool. Alright. We could have just slashed these after running away from him, but... Actually, we probably could have shot him, too. That would have been the quickest way over. Oh, we're just out of ammo, ammo? Shoot. Someone has left their gear here. Well, can I use it? <laughs> Please? Don't tell me that and not let me use it. Oh, I know where we are. Back here now? We still do not have a key for the bird. Right? We do not. Can't believe I use that many uh, rifle rounds. I don't think I thought I had a lot more left. Alright, so we're looking for a key. I found a roundabout way to get back here. That goes back to Dumont. Uh, honestly, I should just come back this way. I just need to go to that that place where everyone tried to murder me. Because this is locked. Looks like a pair of eyes in the wall. Those are eyes. Those are 100% eyes. I don't know what else those would be. And they're gone now, and I'm unhappy about it. All right, well, we're gonna let that we're gonna let that slide, I guess. And that's locked. Hmm. Well, so that's the spooky side of things. Oh yeah, if you run out of energy, it doesn't don't let you sprint till you're back up to full. All right, five of those. We should get our pistol out. Wait, there's not. It's not up here. It's the other. Yeah, item storage is up there. Huh, huh. I'm so excited for this game. It's looking pretty cool. Oh, those are pistol rounds. That's why I thought I had more ammo. Shoot, dang. Okay. Take it all, why not? Uh, boop. Uh, sign. Lift. Do the new left. Bam, look at that. Bam. Down, right? Oh, wait, not here. Can I get more? I want to open. Right, this isn't the way. We don't have anything to cut this. Up is also. Oh, yeah, it's out and around. Um, I almost want to save, but I didn't really do that much. Felt good. Didn't really do that much, though. It's like a moral victory more than anything. If I go over there, though, there's only dudes to fight. Things I don't have keys to. This is the front line. Yeah, the front line. We were here. 
those two routes back. Kind of the way we need to go, I mean. There's the pigeon. We're just here. There's no way in there. Bunch of locked doors all up in here. I'm not sure. Guess let's go kill people one at a time. Or attempt it, I guess. Like, where does it tell me I am when I'm here? Please, sir. Okay. Came in here before. Heard someone get killed. Pistol ammo. Yes. Sounds like someone's getting shot, and I didn't like it. He knows. Whoa! Found a glitch, bro. Found it. And now I found a scary place and I don't like it. Dynamite has been soaked. It's completely unusable like this. Oh man, look at that dynamite. Should have brought the flashlight. Door has been sealed with thick military military grade rope. It's too tightly bound to remove with just your hands. Although it appears to be soaked in an oily substance. You also have a knife! But that's fine. I'll allow it for another lock and key puzzle. Alright, I need to be better about my stealthiness. Stop running into the little cover things when they see me, clearly. Uh, all right. I'm trying to find Pierre still. Uh. Oh! Okay. Okay, I can see. Lightly, lightly armored boys. French flag? Oh, my friend, my friend. A tin of poppies. Yeah. Chemical fluid. You left it. Let's go down in this space. Or not. Oh, I guess I just said no accidentally. All right. Good day. What will it be? Oh, yeah, I keep keep flinching them all right. Looks like it's just you and me left. Uh, it'll happen so fast. Okay. Uh, um, let's see. Do I want to save up for something fun? I got repair kits. I mean, I got guns. I don't... And larger bags are kind of expensive. Ammo pouch could be good. I think I want to sell. I can sell ink. That's actually not a bad idea. So I don't think we got a lot. Like, could sell a couple of these and just get some uh, health and ammo stuff. Ammo pouch. Yeah, ammo pouch is fifteen. Um, at the same time, I'm more concerned with surviving. It's a lot of cigarettes, too. Uh, oh, but wait. He has the same amount of stocks since last time, doesn't he? 
Interesting. So I can only go to the well so many times for heals and stuff is what it's looking like. Let's buy a chemical fluids. Oh yeah, bandage, sure. Yeah, we'll see if he only has one the next time I see him. Shovel. Upgrades. Firepower. Ooh, fire rate, capacity, or reload speed. So we have two. Upgrade this guy, or can I upgrade this guy? Firing quicker. Firing quicker is kind of the, the point of this gun. Whereas this one, I kind of want it to hit harder. And if it hits for two, it hits the same as the rifle. Let's do that. I still have one to play with. Why not? Going full firepower, I guess. Okay. And then, hold on, we will combine. And then we can save this other one for we have a bunch of ammo we can hold on. Gunpowder. Because it was B and chemical fluid make rifle ammo, and A makes pistol ammo. We have a good amount of pistol ammo, so. Yeah, save progress. So it's kind of cool you can save or you can sell your saving items so that you can uh, buy more things. A stream of water is running down the wall. It looks surprisingly fresh. Is something filtering it? I wouldn't risk it though. <laughs> is a scary thought. I wonder if the French flag is an indicator that uh, our buddy will be around. Oh, it's a one of those. Take the bandage. Pick up the bandage. Oh, they didn't make it through the barb. Oh, that poor guy. Take the coop key. Oh, we found the coop key. Sick. You all right? So we found a door. Shoot. Ah, you jerk! I ran through here first. All right, I wanted to see what what that maps me out to. Oh, there could be a way back to the coop. Uh, let's heal and try it. Use it. Yeah. Oh yeah. A. There we go. Okay. Out. All right. Reload. There we go. We're we're doing it. All right, let's, yeah, let's reload that sucker. Let's shotgun some fools, shall we? That's right. Eat it. Germans, right? <laughs> the Germans decided that the world would be their enemy. And you'd think that would be pretty one-sided, but uh, it was actually pretty close. Gosh, I miss... <laughs> Let's say I miss Burt Reynolds. Uh, <laughs> uh, Rip Norm McDonald. Oh, spooks. Oh, what's this? Freaking blocked? Oh, lots of... I don't know if I'm alone in here. I do not know if I'm alone. Sigs. More cigarettes. Stuff to find. Cigarettes. Ooh, lore. On gases. Oh, we're about to get gassed. 
New recruits must be made familiar with the types of gases encountered in combat. Chlorine gas. Oh, dude, there's gonna there's gonna be multiple gases that I need to remember what they do and how they murder me. All right, pale green yellow. Uh, chlorine gas. Excuse me. Parent appearance is pale green yellow. Odor mix of pineapple and pepper. We sh we need smell o vision for this game apparently. That'd be good. So pale green yellow is chlorine. Okay, it's not telling me like what it does, so I'm guessing they're all just bad. Phosphine or phosgene gas appearance is colorless. Odor is musty, similar to that of fresh hay. Prolonged gas exposure effects. Mild, inten uh, mild, intense coughing, severe eye irritation, vomiting, respiratory irritation, shallow breathing, ret retching, severe fatigue, yellow discharge from lungs. Oh, that's 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 the mild, severe suffocation, blindness, late onset pulmonary edema. Fatal symptoms have taken more than twenty four hours to manifest. If skin irritation turns to severe blistering, remove contaminated clothes and wash the affected area thoroughly with disinfectant or alcohol cloth. Gas note has been logged. You've also uh, gained some trauma. Anything? Bottles. These boys had a good time. Well, basically the end of the world. The reflections are pretty good. I like that. He did a good job right there. Yeah, no, it looks good. Throw a budge. Lock pick might do the trick. I'm sadly not the master of unlocking. Hey. Let's go to the coop. Uh, down. No. Okay, cause this is this is the spooky door. I don't like spooky door. Um, this one's not the coop, right? This is just a small room. Is it out and around? Where did coop go? Coop to the left. Or coop to the right. Uh, we have a map for just such an occasion. Coop that way. Um. I can get to the pigeon coop going this way apparently, so let's, let's try that. Okay. I'm gonna use all my stamina. You do not want to lose all your stamina. Lock slow forever. Wait, uh, this is not the right way. I, I made it, boo-boo. Went the wrong direction. Here we go. Nice pigeon. We're just gonna get this note. I wanna, I just wanna tie that to your leg, okay? And we're just gonna send, send you out. It's dead. <laughs> it's just, oh, we just saw you a minute ago, man. There's no way to communicate with command now. God help me. There's something at the back of the cage. Okay, I saw that earlier. Jeez, can you, oh. Do I not, I have to, I have to do that, okay. Oh, poor bird. Who hurt the bird? The cage has been opened, but it's too late. Take the lockpick. Oh, lockpick, okay. That's... Gas, that's a gas, it's gotta be. Right? It's a clear gas. Cause it's similar to the green effect I was getting before. I'm hearing things. I'm not happy about them. 
This door? Yeah. Unlock it. Oh, broken the process and it's been discarded. Okay, so one time use. Why is this room red? It's like fire room. Pair kit, cool. Yep. Sigs. Some sort of trap door is completely sealed shut and won't budge. <gasps> Wire cutters. We can go in the spooky door now. Yay, spooky door. Alright, so we can't get through that. Can I whack it? Yeah. <laughs> I like this this screen shake with that. Alright. Right, we only got four shells in there. Alright, wire door. Where was wire door? Map. <laughs> oh yeah, it's over here. So we're gonna go south. I wonder how long this demo is. So I'm really enjoying it. Yeah, we hear all the bad sounds down here. I wonder if I should have brought my flashlight. There's still time. But that's okay. We're just gonna just gonna wire snip it. We'll have to menu first. Use. The wire has been destroyed. What about the uh do I keep the clippers? I do, okay. Could be helpful for something else. Pierre, he's piece of cloth oh that was it oh no full game coming 2022 Ooh, good add to your wish list. i actually already have it on my wish list you should add it to your wish list too because this, this is exciting press any button to review the results enemies killed 19 total heals six saves four i got a b oh he even graded me on my demo play oh this game is still in early development dude this guy's this guy's got a good he's got a good thing going right here i think he's i think it's gonna be good I don't know, I I like the feel of it. It feels really fun. And it feels I don't know, it's it's got a lot of a lot of similarities to the just the the the, the different survival horrors I love. Um uh, I mean, we got we got Resident Evil playing over my shoulder, one of them anyway. Um and it hits that spot, man. It really, I like the usage of, you know, the, the, the chemical oil thing, you know, you, you can, you can pick your heels or your weapon or making it, making heels or making ammo. Um, and I do like games that give you that choice specifically with, um, survival horror, even though some can argue that it's, it's basically, oh, the developer's just saying, Hey, make what you need. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna divvy things out the way that, you know, I'm not going to play through my game and care that much. Because generally they should know what is more or less a fair spot. Say, hey, you need a healing item here. Hey, you need ammo here. Um, that's offloading it a little bit to the player. But at the same time, I, depending on how you play in this sort of a game, because there is there is a substantial amount of like hiding. You can hide, you can run, you can shoot, you can fight. And the options of how you fight are quite interesting because it feels like when you are holding down the aim button you're you're just you're aiming better right you are you're making sure you land the shot with the with the melee weapons it almost seems like i mean you could be missing but at the same time it almost feels like it's the amount of power you're putting behind especially with like how much they wind back so i don't know if uh Aiming for longer with a gun adds more power to your shot. I mean, it wouldn't make much sense. Um, but the fact that you can miss and then just be completely susceptible to attack is really... Oh, it's fun. It's a fun combat system. It's, it is it is definitely difficult if you have multiple people coming after you. But that shotgun blast we did, though, that was cool. I like that. So the very lightly armored guys are going to get torn to shreds. One hit. Um... Which makes me wonder now, because I guess, yeah, the lightly armored guys did go down with one. Well, they would go down with one rifle shot. And I think my shotgun at that point, I want to say it was still at 1.5 and not 2. 
So maybe they only need 1.5 damage. And I want to say the the guys with the gas masks take three rifle shots. That's six health. And that super armored dude. I don't even know how many bullets I put into that guy. That guy took a lot of shots, man. He was spooky sounding too. Like the image, the image of the 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 cover here. Um, pull up the display capture gun of conscript. You got your you know classic German helmet gas mask guy and he like the the breathing sounds that they get in this game are really are really good and really creepy and it, it makes them sound like monsters like like in, in like a silent hill kind of way is what i'm trying to say like it, it sounds super spooky and like the super armored ones holy crap they're scary like i'm scared of them right now so that was that was very fantastic i'm actually really really content with that that was a lot of fun Oh, I'm super excited. I didn't realize that that was going to end the thing, though. Uh, um, gosh, that was good. That was really good. Oof. Big oofs. Big excitement. Really, really like it. Really, really like it. I'm trying to think of anything else I need to say about it, though. Like, is there anything else that... Uh... Hmm. 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 It's good. I, I'm, I'm already really excited for it. Um, I'm excited it's going to come out in 2022. At least I hope so. I mean, I don't know if um, he's going to get delayed by any means. I mean, it's just one guy doing it. So, brother man, how you doing? Oh, it was a really good game. That was, that was spectacular. Yeah!